What is going on guys, Alex here and welcome back to another video. I remember looking at this game at the start of the season and saying that we need to be on a good run when we play Mansfield away or we're going to get battered. We've not won since the 30th of January. Got no confidence to take or whatsoever. However, look at it in the positive light. We could have been playing Luton last week, but still, I've, I've got no confidence whatsoever. I hope though, Grim is playing today. Don't know if he is 100% okay, but he did look injured last week. Just shut up, for the JD Sports. Big man roadman shop and that. Back on the coach after the game because we left people behind last week. I mean, if you decide that City are losing 4 0 and the game is shitty, you want to go to the pub, that's fine. But please make your way back to the coach. We've got about six defeats. We'll fight to the games. Together, we will never. I don't know, I did say he hasn't had a good game for a while, but this is still going to affect his 10 players on the pitch. Fucking hell! What was he doing, man? What was Lee Birds doing, man? 1 0 to Mansfield. I don't know. Before I get murdered in the comments, I'm sorry, I've watched the footage back. He did nothing wrong. Half time, Mansfield Town 1, Coventry City 0. Coming out for the second half, the first half, same as every week. I'm not even, I'm not even going to talk about it. I'm really not going to talk about it. Nothing changes no matter who we play. Nothing changes. Just add the point that imagine being able to climb over your back garden and getting into a stadium. Shown an attacking threat all game. 
I don't even feel like moaning. I've got to a point where it's every single week. We're saying the same competitive Get that young man. Every time we're coming forward, we're not creating anything. We lose the ball, and then when we are in a good position to shoot, we take way too long. I don't know how. It was not a penalty. We've won a penalty anyway. Michael Doyle, two Check it out, mate. And where we go? Take it, it's 1 1. We can't look at it though, look. We're not losing, but without the penalty, we would be. We've not really created that much of a chance other than the penalty, so. Ponticelli so so close.
Mansfield. I think there's a lot of positivity around the fact that we got a point. Yes, it's a relief. We didn't lose for the first time since, as I said, January. Just, I don't think we've picked really up anything today. Yeah, we played a strong side and we did end the game well, but we say that every week. It just felt cliche us, really. I feel we could have done a lot more to improve. And, I don't know. I mean, it's gone downhill. Uh, the only improvement today was obviously the point in the table. It's still possible for us to go up. I was very positive at half time saying we can still go up. There's no need to go and say, oh, we bottled it. Um, I know I made a video about us bottling it, but we'll forget about that. Uh, well, if you haven't seen it, go and watch it. Leave a like, subscribe to that channel if you know, whatever. Um, subscribe to this channel if you know as well. But yeah, I think we've just got to wait. See see how the next few games go. We've got Lincoln, Luton, Wickham, Barnet. Them few games are important. Barnet are not an easy team to beat as on paper. We should beat them. The other three, pff, are we gonna We'll we'll see. We'll wait and see what happens. Won't be doing the Wickham game, it's obviously on the Tuesday night. Um all the others I'll do though. So yeah, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like, subscribe if you're new. I'll see you guys in a bit. Bye.